In this video, we provide the solution to question number three for practice exam number three for Math 1220, in which case we have to compute the probability as our random variable x varies between zero and two, um, given the probability density function that f of x equals one half times one plus x to the negative three halves power, and for which this density function is defined on the interval zero to infinity. Uh, now, notice if you take the integral of f from 0 to infinity, you're going to get 1. But to find the probability, we just have to compute the integral from 0 to 2 of said function 1 half times 1 plus x to the negative 3 halves power. For which um, you can pull that coefficient of 1 half out in front. Then you have this 1 plus x to the negative 3 over 2 power there. You could do a u substitution x, uh, u equals 1 plus x, du then equals just dx. But as you don't have to change the differential at all, I'm just going to recognize that my antiderivative can be computed as, again, the 1 half comes out front. You're going to raise the power of 1 plus x here to be, you add 1 to negative 3 halves, so you get negative 1 half. You're then going to divide by negative 1 half, which actually makes these 1 halves cancel. You do have a negative sign still um, as you go from 0 to 2. Now, because of the negative sign, I'm just going to switch the boundaries around uh, so that we get 1 plus x to the negative 1 half power as you go from 0, excuse me, from 2 to 0 now. Nope, I didn't switch them. 0 to 2. Uh, one, one more try was necessary there. When you plug in 0, you're going to get 1 plus 0, which is 1. To any power, it's going to be 1. So the first one's just going to be a 1 there. Um, and then you subtract from that, if you plug in 2, um, you're going to get 1 plus 2, which is 3, 3 to the negative 1 half power. I might think of that as 1 over the square root of 3, mind you, but that would be the exact probability. Um, you're going to put that into a calculator, 1 minus 1 over the square root of 3. Uh, you should then end up with 0.4226, etc. That's actually sufficient for us. That gives us um, F is the correct answer. It's about 42%.